Hey, what's up everybody? Too Tall Toby here. And on this beautiful Friday morning, I wanted to share with you a top secret SolidWorks shortcut to help you save time whenever you need to reuse geometry from one part model to another. And so what I'm referring to here is the ability to take a feature like this, like this fin, and maybe copy and paste it from another component like this pink component here. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the rollback bar, I'm gonna roll back to the sketch of that fin, I'm gonna get into edit sketch mode here, and I'm just gonna window select everything from this sketch, and I'm gonna press control C. That's the SolidWorks shortcut to copy sketch information. And of course, it's a window shortcut for copy and paste. Control C to copy, Control V to paste. And so now I'm gonna go back into that other part file and I'm just gonna roll back in the tree here and I'm gonna try to reuse that fin information on this part. So I'm gonna pick this face here, begin a new sketch, get normal to, and then what I'm gonna do is click in the background and I'm gonna press Control V. That's the shortcut for paste. So here you can see I was able to copy all of that sketch information from the original sketch into this sketch, you know, minus anything that couldn't be copied like coincident relationships to the old geometry from the old part. So now I want to move this geometry. And if you've ever been in this spot before in SolidWorks, take a moment and hit the like button because I'm about to show you something that's gonna save you a ton of time. And so what I do at first is I select this geometry with a window. I grab this point here, I go to move it and up. Oh, Everything just kind of goes crazy. All of my sketch relationships kind of update and that is definitely not what I wanted. So hit escape, control Z. So the obvious tool that we could use here would be the move entities command. And the move entities command does work in this particular scenario, but there's been plenty of scenarios where I've tried to use this and it really doesn't give me the results that I want, usually because there are some sketch relationships that are kind of conflicting within this sketch. And so move entities doesn't end up working for me. So what else could I do? Well, I could Windows select this geometry and hold Shift. Shift is usually the shortcut for move in Windows. So I could hold Shift and move this into place here. But now I face another problem. And that problem is that I can't pick up the relationship to that origin point where I want to drag and drop this sketch. So here is the top secret move. This was actually taught to me by another SolidWorks guru. And that top secret move is we come into this new model here. We control V to paste that sketch information down. We window select all that geometry. We hold control. Now control is normally a copy command. We hold control. We start out on this point here and we drag this point and then we stop holding control. We let go of the button. So you'll notice there on my keyboard, I let go of that control button. And now as we continue to drag, we can actually pick up on that coincident relationship and thus we can drop that sketch exactly into the desired location. And that is your quick tip for this beautiful Friday morning. I know this was a shorter video, but sometimes those little tiny nuggets of information can end up saving you hours and hours of time. And this is definitely one of those. So if you enjoyed this video, let me know down below in the comments. Be sure to hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe. And of course, if you're ever interested in getting some training with me, visit us at twotalltoby.com slash training. We've got a great training class coming up later this month. We'd love to see some of you in that class. Otherwise, I hope everybody has a great weekend and I'll look forward to seeing everyone in the next video.